It's going to be a hot one today. We're on the Little Cannon River, later part of September, and it's supposed to get enormously hot today. Might be taking a dip into the river to cool off because it is hot. It is swampy hot. Some really heavy warm air moved in overnight and here we are. It's really nice out for fishing. The fishing are showing themselves. I've seen a few of them already. But uh, you want to go fishing? Put on your coconut oil and a little bit of insect repellent. We got a nice wind though, so let's go. Want to go fishing? Let's start right here and see what is in this spot. Right up. Here. Okay. I'm on the little cannon and it is a little mucky, but I know what the underwater terrain is like and so I'm just going to start taking chances and putting it in there. And that's when I get a snack. In the front of the run, I got a little guy to come out. He's really nice looking fish. He's just a little on the small side. But what he's trying to say right now, ooh, watch out. Oh, there he goes. He's number one. Just flicked off against my hand a couple times and that was it. He was gone. The lure was kind of messed up in his mouth, but I had him in my hand for a second. Let's try and get another one here. See how this works. Got my little boot print there for just a moment. Could have grabbed him, but uh, I did want to show you the colors on him. He was real pretty. Here we go. Let's put it through this run. Sun. Looking good. What the heck was that? Something had it right away and knocked it sideways. Something <laughs> knocked it around. Messed it up. Let's go see what that was. That wasn't quite far enough to the right. I have to get over to the right more. looking home. Wow, did you see that walnut? See, them walnut trees are all along this river. I mean, there's a lot of them. And when a walnut drops in the water, it's very identi very identifiable splash. It's like bloop. But that one hit in the shallows there in just a run. So it was like splash. I screwed up the fish too. Sweat, sweat, sweat. See what shows itself. Have to get into position down here. It's a tough, tough spot to fish from here. Okay, here we go. There's a fish, look at that. There's a nice fish, what is it? Rainbow? Boy, that's a nice looking guy, ain't it? No, it's a brown, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's a brown. Sure it is. Pretty looking guy. 
Let's see if I can get him up and over here. Oh, is he weighty? Oh my gosh. Nice fish. Nice fish out of the jam. Oh. A little over 14, just a little ways. 14 and a half. I didn't look up too quick. But here we go. Let's see if something else is in there. Across the front, maybe. Road crews must be doing something on the road right there. Okay, let's get dragging past some of these leaves here. And up over the log. Come on, undo there. There we go. Oh, is it warm out? Oh, look up there. Look up there. Share in the stream, equal opportunity fisher. Doesn't even know I'm here, I believe. Looks a little hot today, staying in the river, smart, smart deer. Very smart. Well, get out of my hole up there. You, seriously, that's my hole up there. But yeah, <laughs> there's our friendly deer getting all cool in the stream. There we go. Well, back to my fish in here. And obviously there's too much wind and too much noise for it to uh, listen to me. It's not going to bother with me at all. What kind of a fish are we going to see out of here? There we go. Almost caught on a hunk of bark there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Way over there. Let's go over there and try it. Zip it through there quick, see if something gets vibration-wise gets going. Boy, is it warm. Sweat, sweat, sweat. It is hot. Here we're at the deer hole. The deer was just up above here swimming, bathing. Let's see if he left anything ready to fish, 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 fish. Yes. The old deer hole. Oh, and he hit it with the side of his head. You know how they do that. Come on, be careful now. There we go. Not bad, huh? Not bad. Brownie number two. Super nice looking. And we're looking after going for Big Uncle Ed. You go tell him. Open up his big hook jaw and get this spinner in there. But uh, let's see what else is in here. Go and tell him now. Go and tell him. Fish talk. Ooh, what was that? Oh, chubby wubby, big old stream chub. Yeah, I don't know whether to call today's episode Sweat, Sweat, Sweat. Ooh, look at that bugger. We're just plain hot. This is a virtual playground for the big ones here. You got a nice run that goes up around out of our sight along the outer bank over there. And it comes through all this real nice structure. So I'm going to start working this right off the edge of that sandbar. See the sandbar? I hope you do. They like sitting right off the edges and grabbing stuff that comes in on them. That's a favorite little ambush spot of theirs.
guy on the sand. Let's go underneath this structure here. Try and give it to him down in there. I'll let it sink a little bit more. It looks deep, but it's not quite as deep as I thought. Now, right by this point over here, that could be a spot. You see how the water comes across that point and then comes back around that little back eddy? There's a little depth right along that far point. Let's go down in there and see what's there. Little bit of structure to the left, which helps out. Then a leaf gets on my line and messes it up. Them leaves, they can detract from a couple of your casts. Right there, come on. Well, a whole lot of nothing. Start at the top, coming down through that run. Kind of deep in there. There's something. There was something. I think that was something. I don't think there's a structure in the spot where I just hit something, so let's go back in there and see if something will bite. Uh, I think that was, oh, I got a one hit like I did last time, but there was another one behind that, so it's not the same hunk. Come on, you guys, where are you? He's in there, I know he's. This might uh, make a difference too. We're supposed to get some real doozy storms later. Big time storms. This morning in South Dakota it was 80 degrees on one end and 50 at the other just in South Dakota. This is a nice spot. Oh yeah, working this and I got a nice one to come up. He's not super dupe, but he's pretty, pretty big. Look at he's wondering where to go now. He's doing the single head waggle. He's a nice fish. Let's see where he goes. Oh yeah. Look at him. He's still trying to get that out of his head. He's like, what is this? What is this? Oh, what a nice fish. He came out and got it as my spinner was just about out of the water. He came and got it. Oh, look at that. He's still trying. He's got a lot going for him. He's not near done yet. I know that. He's just doing a smart fight. He's very smart. And I'm not pulling him real hard either. You know, that's when they panic is when you try and yank them in right away. Then they're like, no, no. But if you just take it easy on them, they'll do their own thing. Okay. I'm probably going to try and get them back here now. Here we go. Ooh,
18 and three quarter, almost 19. Look at that fish though, super nice. And someday he'll figure out. Nice female, nice female. All right, got one fish that was pretty nice. 18 and three quarter. I actually know where my 19 inch mark is, so he was just shy of that. But that was fun. Finally got a decent fish today. Darn good. The storms are moving in and I'm I'm hotter than swampy hot. I had one nice fish. I didn't see much else, but I had that one nice fish. I had a couple of little guys that I didn't show you that just fell right off my hook. I tried for a big guy in a hole I know is there. He didn't wake up, so I'll try some other time. But we're running out of time for this year and uh, I hope you had a good time. Just piling along so hope to see you next time god bless you i love you all bye now